What's up, Wild Dogs, and welcome to your Monday workout. It's time to start our week off with a bang, and what better way to do that than a fantastic burning workout? All right, so that's what we've got in store for us today some clusters, some thrusters, and some burpees. So, before we get started with that, we're going to start off with some nice stretching, all right, just to loosen us up and get us ready for the workout. So, what I want you to do is two to three minutes of any cardio you want, doesn't matter to me, as long as that heart rate is up and we are sweaty before we start. All right, so once you've finished that cardio, I want you to set a timer, a timer to go off every 30 seconds. All right, we know this nice and well by now. 30 seconds, you're going to do what we call the reverse shoulder stretch. Directly after that, you're gonna do the across body shoulder stretch. Then we're going to do a moving downward dog, so we can alternate in, in and out of a downward dog position. Then we've got two more movements, nice and simple. You'll be doing what we call a Samson lunge. And the last one will be nice and simple air squats. Okay, you'll be doing three to four rounds of those movements, 30 seconds of each one as your warm up. All right, so let's go have a look at those at a demo now. Well done guys, that is our warm up done and dusted. It's time to get ready for our part A. Like I said, there's clusters, thrusters and burpees. All right, that's what we're gonna be doing now. It's gonna go six, six, nine, nine, 12, 12. All right, we're gonna be doing five rounds of all of this. So how it works is you start with six clusters. There'll be three on the one arm, three on the other. Then you'll do six over the object burpees. Now with those clusters, you can do it with a dumbbell, kettlebell or a barbell. All right, nice and simple. You will have it in this position. Obviously for your barbell, it'll be six in total, not per side, all right, nice and simple. All right, then we're going into nine reps. Nine reps will be of your thruster. So that one will be broken up in a little bit more of an odd fashion, five, four. You will determine which arm you do the extra rep on. Then you will be doing nine over the object burpees to follow that. Your final movement will be 12 deadlifts thereafter. Nice and simple, same thing double kettlebell or double dumbbell this time now or your barbell 12 deadlifts followed by 12 over the object burpees okay to end off that sequence we will start with a 400 meter run or you can do 150 single skips once you have finished that you will start your next round all right take a little bit of a break before you can restart on your next round take a bit of a breather get your body ready for that next set all right guys now that we know what we're doing let's have a look at it in a demo All right, part B, it's called 17. All right, so 17 reps for every single movement I'm about to tell you right now. So it starts with sit-ups. It then goes into a plank with a dumbbell touch, shoulder touches, and our final one is ankle taps. You will do 17 reps of each one of those. You'll do four rounds in total. Core work, you can break kind of whenever you want, as long as it's not during a set. I want you to try to hit a full set, so full 17 of at least one movement, then break, then move into the next one, all right? Nice and simple. So those are our movements. Let's go have a look at them in a demo and then we will be done. All right guys, fantastic work. That is us done and dusted for a Monday. I look forward to seeing you in class and then obviously seeing you on Tuesday. Cheers guys, enjoy.